another tournament on over here. Let's give it a go. Give it a whirl. Oh, I need, to, I need to put my mittens on. I haven't put my mittens on. Mittens! Best free game Epic gave out was Farming Sim 19. <laughs> okay, see that. Yeah, is that is that just get Games Planet deal cheaper than it was on Epic? Did that help you out? Right, next tawny. Come on over here, recruit some more troops. Skip, 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 skip. We get a fancy horse. If we survive. Oh, it's the javelin thrower again. Oh, I've, no, no, it's axe thrower. I've got throwing axes though. Yes, I win. That's what I must have had the previous time. I just didn't use my mouse wheel to uh, to get it. Ow. Oof. My horse took... Oh, I did a lot of damage to the horse. Take out this enemy spearman if we can. Yeah, he's dead. Get the spear. Take him out. Why don't I do some trading with all City City? Uh, I could do. I've never found, unless that's changed, I've never found that particularly profitable, not early game, like late game when you've got a, like where you could actually have a large capacity of stuff. I mean, it might work. Well, let's, we'll give it a go. Have a little looky. There we go. He's dead. Skip, skip, skip. Early on, I just find ta tournaments and like hunting down sea, especially for Sturgia, hunting down um, looters and sea raiders is pretty good. Yes, God, my axe throwing is on freaking point. Right, final one. Let's risk it all. Bet, bet, bet. Oh, it's axe throwing again. How many have I got? Three. So he's got three as well. So avoid this last axe throw. Well, that was terrible from him. One. Two. And victory. Hey, you got an axe in your face. Get up. Victory. It's gold piercer. Uh, what do you want? Hmm. Willow Bark. Oh, aren't Willow Barks also good healers? Yeah, not as good as Miss Miss Surgeon. Oh yeah, have I have I assigned you back to your position? No, I haven't. Back in you go. I'll be back as quartermaster. It now doesn't tell you what they do, which is a little bit. I wish it kind of just told you. Hovering over it, that'd be nice. That tells me how many troops what my clan breakdown is, that's cool. Back, 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 back. Um, okay, we could go like, trade. Combine Balagard for four. And sell him Vostrum. No more for 23. I don't know what's good to pick up, to be honest. It's easy to, to share, but we don't, we don't, we don't. Like we don't have enough horse. We need some more horses to make it viable. We are better off just hunting down sea raiders right now. Yeah, we get our OP bro. He's a solid companion. 13 sea raiders. We should be able to manage that. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to get drawn into all of those. Thanks. Come on, let me catch you. I will get you. I don't want it to be at night, though, actually. Oh, did I get in? Yes, I did get in. And we've got Oleg helping us out. Back. Just watch his force take them all out. Oh, so this is the new deployment. Nice. Look at that. Oh, that's great. So you can just spread them out how you would like to. I can only control my force. That's amazing. Uh, 
That's pretty cool. Let's have let's just have my guys over here. That's actually me, isn't it? That's my my character where I get to choose where I start. Ready. Oh, sweet. Oh, no, I want to be the commander of that. Oh, so you can literally put in different commanders and stuff like that. That's, that's cool. Do I need different formations? How do I... Because he's got to go in there because he's not mounted. Right. Hear me! Get moving! Hear me! Onward! Hear me! Warriors! Oh, I just got a sign. Oh, then we... Yeah, we've got none in that, though, but you just have to assign that anyway. Cool. Nice. Warriors, everyone. Oh, so he's in his own separate group. Warriors. That's Warriors. pretty Hear cool. Hear Warriors. I'm in with them. Why is he on his own set? I could put him in his own group, didn't I? I didn't put him in with this. Warriors. Told Hear me. Warriors. Warriors. Keep close. Follow me. That's cool. I like that. That's going to be great for, yeah, larger battles. We'll let the... We'll let Olak, Olak's troops do the... Uh, talking. Infantry. Move out. Javelins, my lord. Charge him down. Stuck in. Got him. Cheers, chaps. Thanks for the assist. I only get 7% of the loot, though. Better than nothing, though. Better than nothing. Large Sea Raider Force and 14 over here. We should be able to take them out. Oh! Fight me if you dare. Yeah. We fought worse odds before. Let's do it. Cool, especially on this high ground. I definitely need to set them to the same formation. We've lost we've lost a unit, so oh. why didn't I get to choose the the formation today? Let's start. Face your javelins on me. How many javelins do you normally have? Like four, five? War attack now. Uh oh, that is not looking good at all. Oh crap, that went really, really bad. Yeah, that went badly. 
I'm getting captured, aren't I? And just got speared. Oh, more of them are coming. God, die, mate. No, that's me down. Ah, no. No. Oh, yes, free me. Free me. He's been free from cat. Yes. Thank you. Where is he? He's at Varcheg. Okay, we've lost all of our troops again, but at least he's not far. Have I still got my fancy stuff? Yes, I do. Ooh, is that better than what I've got? No. It's okay. No! Looters! Yeah, yeah. I need to a sour sweet. Yes, I do. Hang on. I might have to do two here, though. This is a cool map. Stop throwing pissing rocks. Ah!
Dickhead. <sighs> You're my prisoner now. Oh my god, I'm traveling so slowly. Oh, I'm going to get sea raided. Why am I going so slow? Oh, because I'm encumbered. Um... Um, um, oh god, I did get that horse. Oh wow. What do I need riding skill? 90. I might just sell you. I got two of them. Yeah, I'm definitely selling those horses. Uh, wait, I'm not going to use them. Um, actually no, keep them because they barely weigh anything. It's going to be the beer. Chuck the beer. Oh, it's the gra uh, Chuck one bit of grain. No, I'm still going to get caught. Not the bear. Uh, prisoner. No, they're still going to catch me. I can't get to the village. I'm going to get caught. Oh, they just, they'll take some money. Run, run, run! No looters! Ah, <sighs> take my gold. <laughs> I'm waiting here. That was bloody tough. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, is he, is he moved on from where's he gone now? He's a rebel. Okay. I am going to trade those horses in for lots of money. Because they're no good to me right now. Oh my god, coat of plates. I mean, we're not obviously going to... Oh, yeah. That's the stuff. The waste. I'm glad they've added some extra weapons. What have we got here? Two-handed sword, veteran warrior axe. Cool. Get some more recruits from over here, then head over to Revel, which is over there. There will likely be sea raiders. I'm going to throw in a, another save here. Uh, the Attenborough impression. I just saw that. Here is Richard Snowbeard. He was a strong man, but like all great men, he had a weakness. Superman had his kryptonite. Sir Richard, well, Sir Richard had pointy rocks, which were absolutely marvellous. At taking our brave hero down. There's a tournament here. Wait, yep. Take back to party. You're a wanderer who is. They're all right, but I'm not going to bother with you. I am instead going to recruit all of those lovely troops, and then we're going to wait here until I'm nearly healed up, and then we'll uh, try and do the tournament if it's still here. Mm. A better bow might be a good idea, actually, yeah. Uh, we'll have a look at the trader. A noble bow, bloody hell. Them cost a bit. Stack buddikin arrows. What have we currently got? We've got a hunting bow. Yeah, accuracy is pretty... Oh, it's, well, it's 85, it's alright, but it's the missile speed. We want reload, faster reload, really. 
the first bow they actually have available is a Nordic short bow. Which is nice, but I don't want to part with uh, 1,500 coin. Not yet. Another one of them. So yeah, what are we still missing on establish my clan? Just some renown. And with that we talked to two nobles. Cool. Let's wait here. Tawny it up. Probably only going to be here for like one more day, so we'll see how much health we're on by the towards the end of it. We've already we need to go hunt down some people to get some money back up because we've lost like three days. Oh, actually, I'll heal up a bit faster when I if I slap him back in as surgeon. Maybe. Oh, we can actually see our healing rate as well. Surge, yeah, there we go. Surgeon healing rate increases it. All right, stop. Let's go to the arena. Join the tournament. See what they've got. Ooh, a veteran warrior axe. No. Let's do it. Oh, I've got a bow. Doesn't look good. Does not look good. That, yeah, not good. <laughs> Got screwed over by my team. Uh, someone's at the keep. Um, but not worried about that. Let's hunt some easy looters. They'll get stuck down here. That tawny went well. We're going to link on up with those guys and we'll fight them all together. They're going to chase those villagers. Don't be nighttime. Don't be nighttime for the battle. Nope. We're going to have daytime. Beautiful. Surrender or die. Yeah! Warriors! Hear me! Form a wall! Yeah! I've got a few archers in my ranks now, haven't I? Sodding rocks. Beautiful. No one had died. Two wounded. Yoink. And Woodsman. Yeah, we're going to make you guys. Uh, we're going to go through the hunter lines. We'll have you as archers. Now I'll have you guys as warriors. Let me just sort you guys out. You got up here. Soldier up there. Warrior there. No, you're already a brigand, so you're going to go towards that. That's fine. That's like a cub heart has just woken up. Hey, not a happy bunny. Right, head on back. How much more renown do we need? Not gonna bother with those losers. I'll go for a slightly larger group if I can. <clears throat> right. Um oh, we can actually get some hunters and stuff here. Let's ask where the nearest tournament is. Epicrotia, okay. Let me actually get rid of that brigand because he's not going to help with what I want to do and get rid of those two recruits. And then I can recruit you and you. Oh, we need another recruit. Whoops. I'm 
Okay, so head to Epicrotia. If you want to go the other direction, you've got one of those super spicy chips. Oh, the one chip challenge. Yeah, I was originally going to do that. But the thing is, I'm up for doing it. But spice just ruins my insides and my bum. <laughs> so I will really suffer for it. I'm up for giving it a go at some point. Um... I mean, maybe, maybe I'll get one for the... Just to say thanks to you guys for all the fundraising we do in January. I'm also low on food. That's true. We are going to be... Days until no food, one. Should be able to stock up at Epicrotia. Which you gained a level. Nice. And we've got some riding perks. Have a chance of your mount becoming lame or dead. Halves the chance of it becoming lame or dead after it falls in battle. Or increase your mount's hit points by 20%. I honestly think I'm going to go for veterinary because I reckon with m how I go in things, that's probably a good shout. Athletics, it's your movement. Let's do morning exercise or head towards that rather. Tactics. Um, you're 10% more damage in cavalry simulations. Use formations. Um... Uh, in troop simulations, your troops 25 when using line, circle, or scatter formations. Less morale penalty. I do tend to use shield walls, so I go for tight formations. Yeah. Yeah, we're starving. Uh, my party morale is really bad. Let's buy some food before I forget. We need to go up to uh, Balagard so we get... Or Balgard, I always call it Balagard. Balagard so that we can get some fish cheap. Join the tourney. The laced cloth helm. Yeah, you're both down. Right. Yeah, we've got what? Four forty two now. It's good good odds. You're not so good, it's three V two. I'm good, thanks, Killer Cruiseman. How are you, man? Granary is empty, sir. Do I still have the loot from the loot? Oh, I should probably go through and check, yeah. I feel like maybe I still do have some loot from the looters that I need to sell. Caught the spear while it bounced. Nice cold glass of orange aid. Lovely. Oh, right in the face. I'm going to risk betting from here. Nice. 2v1. It's back turned to my archer. Lovely. Job done. Right. Come on. We can do this. Imperial veteran infantryman. I got it. I got it. I got it. Yes! 
Victory! Oh, there's blood all over my eyes. Beautiful. We got a helmet. Huzzah! Yoink. Uh, yeah, the rest of this can go to... Being sold. Lovely. Um, how's that far and now? We need five more. Okay. Let's head on over. Uh, we're gonna go up here, won't we? Algard. Go, let's go, let's go. All our troops are healed. And it's five o'clock, which means it's um it's beer horn o'clock to celebrate over five hundred subs at five PM. Right, let's do this tournament. Uh, no, don't, don't go into the keep. Do this tournament, then we'll do the beer. And then skulls in chat. For Ooh, lamella pauldrons. They would be lovely. Yes, please. But I don't make it through this first round, though. Oh, I love an axe. are so fast in this as well. One-handed axe. I love them. The combat feels so much improved as well from when the game first came out. It's so much more fluid and, like, faster. Also, I guess my movement in is increasing my speed as well. I'm noticing it because my one-handed skill is increasing. But this this feels more like... I think this is probably one of the most satisfying melee combat that I've done or I've experienced in a game before. Like the shield movement as well. Pretty solid. Right, we'll start betting from the next round, I reckon. Oh, yeah, I got... Oh, nice. Oh, Dragon Man, that's the king. You kick them onto stakes. You, I don't have the axe still. It's still with Darker. <laughs> it's still with Darker and Millie. I need to get it back. They borrowed it for a fancy dress they had. I'll waggle the sword at the end of this. I'll get it back at the weekend. Uh oh. This is uh, this is not good. So close. Ah, oh, I could have just taken him down. I should have probably just run on over and tried to grab the other guy's sword. So close. Sword waggle. Three, two, one. That's the stuff. So we've done the tournament here. We can't get into the keep. What do we need? We need for our mission teeny tiny bit more renown. We tried that tournament. We failed. Let's go hunt some faces. Uh, we're going to get some fish while we're here because it's cheap. Uh, not that much fish. Unless we can get some cheap horses. Not really. I need to do a run to the Kuzate land really. after those sea, sea raiders eight of them should should yield good pickings no no loric i saw it first it's mine 
Never mind, you can go. They, they're just going to get all the loot anyway. I won't get all the, the good stuff from it. Let's go this way. We could get a load of mules. I always tend... To, are mules worth doing now? I always tend to just go for... Uh, lots of war horses. Just to increase my party speed. I always find that slightly more important. Also, I'm really glad that every time... I don't, we've not had to reload. In the past, it would always... Sometimes when you went in and out of battle and stuff, you had to shrink your map bar and stuff. That was kind of annoying. Barnapol's got a tournament. Let's try our hand there. Let's try our hand here. Come on. Into the arena. <gasps> Ring mail barding. I want... I'm gonna I'm gonna go 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 bold here. I'm gonna go big. I'm gonna bet every single round. Have faith. The beer fuels me. I will have vengeance on all those that would see me perish. Ow. Uh oh, this is not going to go well. This is not going to go well because we are. I don't know how many. Okay, yeah, no, I'm going to lose. No, yeah, I'm dead. It's all on the one horseman. No, he's dead. Damn it! No! <sighs> How did Sir Richard lose his, all his gold? He went to the tournament, half cocked and drunk, bragging about how he could win the whole thing. Bet all his money. Yep. Yep. Silly, silly Richard. I need more cap, no more horses as well, so I can actually catch some sea raiders on them constantly outrunning me. Oh, I might get them through the trees here. We are slightly faster than them. This will work. We call that a Tuesday. <laughs> hey, uh, Electric Gaming. How you doing? Didn't pass second round, no. Render or die. Attack. Engage the enemy! Yeah, charge. We got the numbers. A good Tuesday at that, yeah. Soldiers! Got him. They're all dead. Nice. Two of us wounded, but that is all good. We've got a cub heart. He's come for a visit. Hello, bud. Let's kill some brigands. Die. Attack. Let's slaughter some raiders. Ah, uh, no rocks this fight, Lionheart. Yeah, it's all good. Oh, we gained some troops from it. Nice. Right, let's upgrade these guys. Uh, spearman or line breaker? Where do we want to go? We want to go through... I want to go spearman to then get heavy axemen. We don't want the heavy spearmen. We want the heavy axes. The heroic line breaker is nice, but they're basically kind of like berserker types because they've just got the double great-handed... Uh, great-handed? Great axe. <laughs> Two-handed great axe is the word. I'm smishing word. Smishing? I'm pissed. I've had that. That beer's hit me hard. We want the Sturgy and Heavy Axemen. That's what we want. <laughs> oh, dear. So, yeah, we want the spears. Give me that sweet, sweet spears. Warriors, up we go. 
And Stogian Warrior. Okay, so what do we want from here? We want Stogian Warrior. Uh, and we want the Veteran. And we'll have the... We'll have the Cavalry Recruit as well, actually. And give me all that sweet, sweet loot. Then we go sell it. That's the beer. What about the axe? Let me take a look at general chat. Oh, nice. <laughs> Love those picks. That's awesome. Oh, and I saw Dark Sylvian's uh, post when I was having the sour sweet. Amazing. Love it, guys. Am I I'm not a vassal yet. No, we've literally just started today. So um, we're getting up to clan tier two. And I think from there we can get more. Keep all that. Keep the cav. Sell that. Sell that. I'm going to have to buy some horses at this rate. expensive i'm gonna have to sell probably the gr the fruit dates yeah um take out those looters 14 if we can how close are we now surely 47 okay so far this game feels so much better than when i last played nearly a year ago it's it's a lot of fun. We're going to continue with this Richard character, though, for the next few weeks. We'll be streaming more of this next week, uh, recording at the same time. I'll probably cut it up into several different episodes. I might upload it in one big chunk. I don't know yet. Depends how much time I have to edit, basically, <clears throat> over Christmas. Either one big chunk or probably two episodes from this first part. Um... And then, yeah, we'll stream this for the next few weeks until this goes public, and then we'll start a new campaign. Hear me! Get moving! Get mo Arrows! Forward! Hear me! Move out! If you look at the snow effect, it's hideous. Snow effect? What snow effect? Okay, look, I'm not having that, mate. Stop throwing stones at me, you douche. No, I didn't mean to end it. I wanted to kill you. Damn it. It seems like experience is, is more evenly, like, shared now, which is good. <clears throat> I'm playing vanilla because we're on the 1.7.0 beta. Uh, so there's very few mods, as far as I understand it, that are compatible. Need one more bit of renown. Teeny tiny bit more renown. <clears throat> Holding off getting banned, all the first game was one of your favorites. Next review put me off. It's much, much better now, yeah. Obviously, I'm not that far into this to really be able to give this version a full recommendation but the way i see everything working and just the general improvements in the early game that we're currently experiencing today i think you know i'm feeling fairly confident that um everything else that they've done up to this point then so far is going to be pretty solid and that it's definitely kind of at a at a, at a point where i can definitely give it a solid recommendation Let's hunt down these 10 looters if we can. Once we've got a little bit more money, we need to go to do a, a Kurzet run. Although, actually, probably with nearly 2k gold, we could probably do a Kuzet run with that for horses. We'll kill these guys as dawn breaks. I mean, if you're a fan of the series, like, the game's been worth it from the start, but... It's definitely had... You know, it's been hard work at times.
There we go. Boom! I'm playing the game since launch. I hope they... <laughs> Ladders and sieges are fixed in the latest beta, which is the, the one we're currently running. So if you've been holding off for that, it's now apparently fixed. Enjoy. Boom. Boom. We now are lacking in money, aren't we? Oh, and our party's... <laughs> Our party's like, okay, we can recruit someone from here, surely. We'll be able to complete that first bit of the quest. Bada bing, bada boom. There we go. Not quite enough to get what we need. We need to recruit one more troop from there. We can actually go up to the next tier. Um, Because we've gone up the clan level, but we need a little bit more gold. So I'm just going to enter the arena and ask where the nearest tournament is. We'll try and fight someone in between now and then. Tile and Macabre. Okay. But they're saying Tile, which actually kind of works out for us because that's near Kuzate territory. So we'll head over there. If we see any um, looters on the way that are actually coming our way, we'll go for them. That we can actually catch as well. They're 4.4. We won't be able to catch them. Go, go, go. Oh, 16 Sea Raiders. Actually, that'd be fun to, to kill. You get some good loot from that, and then we could head to Tile. We, well, we might lose, actually, the number of troops that we've got. Also, because they're grouping on up quite aggressively. Right, there we go. Filter them out. They are actually probably running faster than I am going right now. Ah, damn. I can't quite reach them. No, okay. The Tile it is. Tournament. First time catching the stream in ages. I'm good, thanks, Jack. How have you been? Yeah, getting used to life with uh, with Cub Heart. It's all good. Just got here, uh, Scarlet. We are... Well, we've been trying out Bannerlord 1.7.0. Uh, and so far, I'm bloody loving it. Very happy with all the tweaks and changes. The game feels so much better than the last time I played it, which was nearly a year ago. Oh, we should actually yeah, talk to this guy because uh, you know about the main quest. Let's just get that done. Thank you. Before we end up at war with them. Uh, to the arena, join the tournament. And we're going to do some aggressive betting. Yes, we're playing. Well, we're playing as a lord. Well, we're playing as a character in Sturgia right now. We're trying to join them soon. But I need to... I think, I think I can actually join them as a mercenary now. Or maybe it's the next clan tier. I think it's maybe the next clan tier that I can actually become a vassal. Got him. Nice. Bet, bet, bet. We're going big. Try and get all the monies. Oh, it's throwing axes. There we go. That's a win. We're so easy on that stage. Yeah, this is, good. this is going to be a mini series for now. Uh, we'll be doing a full series when 1.7.0 beta goes public. And we'll have a vote to decide whether my character starts off as Batanian or Kuze. Uh, we just come back to, to Sturgia because that's where we did my first series. And I was like, it's a good, it's a good place to do a testing point from. Yeah, it's so easy. So easy just to headshot him with that. Nice taunt's over. We've gained some uh, ringmail barding for our horse, which is beautiful. We've established our clan. That's upgraded. Let me just pop this on my horse because that is crackers. 
beautiful horses, nice and armored now. So let's take a look at the next quest we've got. Establish your clan. Uh, we've now got to do that nobles thing. While we're over here. Oh, what's this? Oh, my family. Oh, no. It's the slaver. You escaped. What happened to my brother? Oh, he got betrayed. Yeah. No way, Galter is free to attack him. Same as Gather. You've got to go save my brother. I can live with that. Let's go. Where is the brother? He is... Oh, the hideout is near Tile. There it is. Okay. Let's go save me, bro, because he's an awesome companion to have early game. Oh, hang on. Let me just go drop, sell these Sea Raider prisoners. Why don't I create my own kingdom? Just have to capture a battle or a battle. Yeah, I'd rather be well established, to be honest. And I also like playing up through the ranks of another kingdom first and like using that to kind of springboard a load of um a load of kind of like loyalties and relationships with other characters to then bring them over to my own faction. So we'll start off as Batania and um well either Batanian or Kuzate. We'll join those factions, rise up through the ranks, do a fair bit of conquering, and then we'll probably try and go it alone with our own faction towards the late game. What's the best uh, morale uh, choice for slaver kill or let them off? Uh don't actually know. Wait until nightfall to attack. Set up our ambush. Right, what do we want to take in? Uh so let's take off the archer. Let's pop in another spearman. We get air of cars to fight me. That'd be good fun. Do I need to complete the talk to ten lords mission to recreate the flag and establish your own? Um, I think, yeah, you might need to. That's fine. We can do that. You know. Hey, learn how have all cavalry. Torf.exe stopped working, yeah. Right, we've got to go into this camp to save our brother. In my opinion, what is the best Warhammer 2 faction in terms of mortal empires? Uh, really tough because there's so many factors that influence that. Um, and I would say influence, yeah, my choice. There's not, I wouldn't say there's one, there's one sole faction that's like the best. It's more depending on who you want to play as and how you want to play. I mean, like my, my favorite series that I've done so far in Warhammer 2, uh, in Mortal Empires would be Ikit Claw. Just because Skaven nukes, you cannot go wrong with that. But, um... Yeah, like, some people might find Empire way more compelling or or another faction. And there's, there's a lot of good, good campaign options in there. A lot of different factions that offer something unique and different. Kind of depends on playstyle and faction preference. I don't think there's one that really stands above the others as going, like, this is the definitive... Warhammer 2 Mortal Empires experience. Uh, if, you, if you've not played... Like, Torox would be a good shout for Mortal Empires. Oxyotl's a great shout for Lizardmen, Mortal Empires. Um, and Ikit Claw for Skaven. I mean, I could probably give you my, my favourite Lord uh, for Mortal Empires per race. But yeah, I don't I don't think there's one faction that really stands well above the others. Immortal Empires, I think they're all reasonably like they all offer something depending on your preference of faction and playstyle. Every <clears throat> dwarf mortal I mean like Thoric, I would say. The the brand new free LC dwarf. Because he's just got a very unique start position and offers offers some interesting, cool playstyle choices. Oof, I'm nearly dead. I am so close to dying. 
Oh, I'm now going to face him and I'm going to, I'm going to die. It's not good. I'm going to choose the option that has everyone fight. Remember my brothers and sisters. Men, attack. Yeah. Take him out because I'm about to die. Kill him. There we go. Kill the slavers. Beautiful. Yeah, um, Snitch. Deathmaster Snitch is great as well. So many cool mechanics. Heavy Axeman. Oh, that's the stuff we want. There we go. Stogie and Heavy Axeman. Yeah. Boom. Look at those boys. Oh my god, look at Gimme All That Loot. Yes! And it's my brother. Scared but fine. Brother and sister are all good. I'll take them to Tyler immediately. They'll be safe there. Cool. Meet me there later. I'll tell you everything. Okay. Continue. Killed. Your men killed my parents. Did you really think you would not be punished? Yeah. Your many crimes, your life is forfeit. Perhaps by saving my brother and sister, you earned your life back. Ooh, okay. What should we, what should we do for this one, guys? Shall we let Radagos, whose men killed our parents, should we let him go? Because he helped us save our brother and sister. Uh, or shall we execute him for his crimes? I shall for your many crimes, Radagos. Your life is forfeit. Execute him. Chop. All right, let's go sell all this swag. We're on 1% health there. Wow. Ooh, so the Kuze and the... Uh, oh, what's this? Education. She's reached the age of 15. She needs your guidance. Oh, wow. <gasps> we get to influence how our family members... Oh, cool. Uh, 14th birthday. Oh, it said 15th. But at a 14th birthday, you give Alishka a special present. You have seen her treasure it and believe it will shape who she is. You give her a magnificent steed, a tree ties on siegecraft, a finely carved game board, a well-tempered bow, a trip to your realm's court. Well, what's that? Well-tempered bow. There we go. Bow skill increases. Look at her go. In adolescence, she begins to take on serious responsibilities and compete with adults as a near equal. She managed to defeat her fencing instructor, win a race, craft a weapon, Learn the arts of healing, become a crack shot, or trade like a veteran merchant. Become a crack shot. Oh, yes. Outside events also intruded on Alishka's adolescence. You believe she was particularly shaped by natural disasters. The event increased her skills in smithing and engineering. Okay. Nice. We've actually got ways in which she... You can influence your siblings and your heirs, I assume, as well. And Fodor has reached the age of 12. You are usually away from your estate, but when you are able to spend time with Fodor, you encourage him to develop his strength, his endurance, a thirst for knowledge, a sharp mind, a good eye and a steady hand, an interest in people. A good eye and a steady hand. We're going to make them both archers. Um, one day, the chart asks you which of your skills was most useful to you. You thought for a while and answered pole arms, tactics, steward, engineering, leadership, and trade. Steward, we shall say. While spending time with this child, you notice that he shows real ability in scouting. Lovely. Good. That's cool. An archer and an engineer. Yeah. Let's go talk to these guys because they're another one that can do the main quest for us. Which is good before we become a mercenary to join against the Kuzates. Then we'll want to go into their lands and buy a load of horses now because it'll be difficult for us once we're at war with them. Let's go trade. Jump in here. Let's keep the stumper horse for the moment. Keep the step horse. Lovely. Sell the worn harness. Sell the light harness. I could put my ally on mount as well, but I'm not going to. I'm going to keep him as infantry. Sell that. And reap the rewards. And also come back into my party for a moment. And yeah, how can I how can I set up the initial battlefield deployment again? Like, why don't I get a chance, a choice to do that? Uh, let's head on over where to this settlement over here to buy some horses. We probably could buy them from here, but we'll buy them from the heartlands of the Kuzay Empire. I need to pop some points in here. Quick adjustments decrease your bow accuracy, loss due to rotating by 
or rapid fire. Increase your bow reload speed. I'm going to go for rapid fire just because I've noticed I'm really slow reloading. Athletics. Increase your movement by 3%. Uh, yes, please. Rather than the maximum hit points right now. That's what I would prefer. Party. Oh, you've yeah, got some bandits to trade away. That's fine. I think it's tactics based skill. But I was able to do it beforehand. How come how come I can't do it again now? Uh quest. Establish a clan. Oh, I need to go actually talk to my family in Tile, don't I? He's in there. I should go get him. We'll do it on the way back. Uh stump horse mule pull free. Well, the step horse, because they are cheap as chips. And they are also counted as war horse, so they will increase our speed quite nicely. Can't quite afford all of that unless I sell some fish and grain. And we need some to pay for my men's um, pay. But that should do us for now. We can also do a tournament. Let's do one last tournament before we wrap things up for today. Good way to end it. Straight saber. Uh, we'll save our betting for the final round because we've got barely any money left. Hit with a red team. Yeah, Mom. him down okay it's just us versus one green left bring him down there we go beautiful nice spear my lord thank you okay horse arch time realize I'm not a full strength. That's that's not smart. down. Spear the archer. Nice. Right. Oop, missed. Nice. Through to the next round. Oh! Bollocks. I just got javelined straight away. Cock. AI, don't screw it up for me. I need you to win now. You're going to get javelined, probably. Or speared. Uh-oh. No spearing is how... <laughs> well, yes. Hey, come on. Turn around. Avoid. Do not go into the infantryman. No! Ah, oh, you idiot. You're dead now. You're very dead. No. You're very dead. Yeah, you're dead. Dang it. Okay, well, that is where we'll wrap things up, I think, for today. We've got a load of cavalry now. We'll rush on back to Tile at the Southern Extreme and recording to go talk to our brother. And we'll carry on from there. We'll try and join the Sturgeon Empire as a mercenary next. And then uh, become a vassal. And just have some more fun. Continue to test out this beta. Uh, enjoying all the tweaks and changes that have occurred 
over the last 12 months basically since i last played if you're watching this on youtube i will have probably cut this up into like two hour and a bit chunks or so over the next few days so i hope you've enjoyed join the stream next week for more uh battle lord action and more recordings until then take care and ciao for now